was like right behind our car. Welcome back to another episode of Behind the Braids. In this episode, you're gonna follow us along as our family does spring break, but this year we did it in Africa. Kimberly says that this, she thinks, was her favorite spring oh, break. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I'm gonna have to agree with her. This was a really awesome trip, one of my favorites for sure. Now, the littles didn't come with us because they're just too little to make the huge long flight and deal with the time changes. So they got to stay here with the babysitter and we've thrown in some pictures of what mm -hmm. fun things they got to do <laughs> while we were in Africa. If you guys haven't already checked out Brooklyn and Bailey's lyric video, you need to do that. You can click the I button right here and find it. It's so awesome. We incorporated tons of videos from all of their fans and all of their followers. Yeah. It's very fun. And don't forget that their actual music video is releasing in just a couple short weeks. So be sure to check that so out as well. Close. Yay! <laughs> all right, let's go. Hey guys, we are on our way to Africa. We have, what, 14 and a half hours? 14. And a half hours. Not as long as Dubai, but not as long as Dubai, but it's still pretty long. Yeah. Basically, we've been traveling for like the past like 24 hours. A long time. A really, really long time. And we just barely made it to our hotel and so we decided to kind of hang out and find somewhere to eat and just like look around, you know, kind of get a feel for things before we start like our adventure for the we next nine days. Fun. Yes, we did. And we are currently chilling here. The scenery is amazing. Table yeah, check it out. This is Table Mountain. The sea right there. That's Table Mountain, right there. Today we are taking a tour of Cape Town City and then we're going to see some penguins and we're super excited. So we were driving and all of a sudden the driver stopped because oh, there's a on, bunch of on the side of the road. There's even this little baby. Uh, <laughs> and they're like coming in front of our bus so we can drive because we stop it. It's hilarious. So we are driving along Chapman Road and we stopped where? At an overlook by Hout Beach. And check out the view. Ta-da! It's literally beautiful. Look at how gorgeous this is. Like, I knew it was gonna be pretty coming here, but like, I didn't realize it'd be like literally everywhere I look. I'm just like, oh, oh hi. <laughs> I'm taking pictures. We're taking like literally our whole family's got their cameras out. We're ready to go. I'm touching the water at the very bottom right corner of Africa right now. Like literally the bottom of Africa right now. Also water that's touching Antarctica. So we're on the bottom of Africa, touching water that's touching Antarctica. Rylan, yes. where are we going? To this lighthouse that's like very far away. <laughs> Exactly how far away do you know? Uh, probably a mile. <laughs> that far away. <laughs> it's all the way up there. We have stopped for lunch and there is an option for ostrich on the menu. Okay, this is my first bite of ostrich. Right? You know, you are what you eat, right? It doesn't taste bad, it just doesn't taste good. What do you mean it doesn't taste good? What else did it taste like what I thought it would? <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah. We got some non-adventurous eaters over here getting yeah. fettuccine alfredo. Yeah. Where are we headed, Rylan? To go see the penguins. To see the penguins. They are so cute. But you can see, I don't even know if you can see them. Cleaning them for them. 
many penguins do you think we just saw? <laughs> like, at 2,200. 2,200, I was gonna say 200. And Dad, where did they come from? 1984, four penguins, two breeding pairs, created all of that. So, we are at the final stop of the day and it is the Botanical Garden. With Kirsten Bosch. I think I said that right. Kirsten Bosch on the Garden. Like we've literally oh, walked like no. three steps in and it's seriously so pretty. So he said there's something like these walkways in the, in the trees, trees or something. So that's where we're headed. We are at the top of Signal Mountain? Signal Hill. Hill. Signal Hill. That's where they like shoot off like a gun at 12 o'clock every day. And the view is very nice up here, I will say. So I'll show you guys. Robin Island. Robin Island over there. Where, uh, Nelson. Nelson Mandela was imprisoned. Where he spent 18 of his 28 year, years. years over there. Hey guys, we're on our way to go donate some school supplies to some local kids. We're gonna go drop it off at a hostel and we then we'll like bring it to the six kids. Bags. Yeah, we have like crayons, markers, scissors, pencils, erasers, papers, papers, toys, toys jump yeah, rolls. chalk. All that's fun stuff Band -Aids, that they can the use. Things. Yeah, and we're gonna go drop it off at a hostel and then they will take it to the school for us. We kept a couple of them so that way we could hand them out to the kids personally, but for the most part, we're just dropping them off now. All right, so after passing this like little neighborhood it's earlier, we had to come back. We had to come back. Check out the cuteness. It's just like a bunch of houses with all these fun colors. This is so cute. Some of you asked earlier where Rylan was in some of our pictures. This is where Rylan has been. Because why Rylan? I'm sick. Rylan decided to come down with strep while we were gone. <laughs> She's actually looking a little better now. Yeah. Good thing we had some antibiotics with us so she's hopefully gonna be feeling better tomorrow and not running a fever. For shark diving. Yeah. Super excited. Hey guys, it's Bailey and it is what time right now? We woke up at 4.15 and drove. No, well we woke up at 3.30. Left the hotel at 4.15 and now it's 7. So we had quite a drive. But we have arrived and guess what we're doing today? Great shark white shark. Cage diving. Also, in case you guys are wondering, I got a bug bite underneath my eyelid right here, like right here. So my eye is super swollen right now. So if that's why it looks funny, like one eye is swollen and the other eye is not. That is why. <laughs> Mom is going to go <laughs> How was it? <laughs> Do you want some hot chocolate? Yeah. My hands are freezing. <laughs> but we saw a shark. <laughs> so Rylan, you want to tell us what just happened? Yeah. Uh, I threw up. She just threw up. <laughs> Either seasickness or not feeling good. One of the two. Seasickness. Seasickness. Came pretty fast too. All right, it's Brooklyn's turn to go in and dad. Are you nervous? Excited? I'm nervous to be cold. Hey Brooklyn, wave your hand. This is incredible. Literally. Holy cow. Okay, so after 
after a full day of traveling, we have finally arrived to destination two. We are currently in, well, we're on the outsides of Johannesburg. We are in this like outdoor hotel in the middle of what they call the bush. We're in the middle of nowhere, pretty much. And I like cute little huts. And then we get to go on like, like three safaris while we're here. And it's just like super cute and ooh, I'm so excited. How early in the morning? Six. It's six o'clock in the morning and we are about to go on our second no, it's safari. Not almost seven, really. We're about to go on our second safari. We went on one yesterday and we saw elephants, like a huge herd of them. We saw a black mamba, which is like this really dangerous snake. It was like, really like feet long. Like how how number ranking of poisonous five. snakes. It's number number five, five in, the in the world. And it's the first snake they've seen. Scary? All I think yes. So we're about to go adventure a little bit more and see if we can find more animals. Our goal is to see giraffe today. Or That's zebras. what we want to see, or zebras, yeah. We're getting up close and personal. So we just got back from a safari and basically what happened was, first we were like wishing to see giraffes and we saw them and there was actually a lion chasing them. And so they were like running and there was one that literally ran like, how, how close was it to our car down? It was like, it was 10, like yards. 10 yards away from our car, like just booked it and it's just massive animal we're all like oh my gosh it stopped and it was like walking around as we walked up to it and i guess drove up to it and it was like right behind our car and my mom was freaking out because it's this giant cat and anyway we started circling our car so we we're like booked it out of there but we got a video and it was so cool so today is our last safari it's bright and early in the morning and then after this we pack up our stuff and we head out we have a three hour bus ride to the airport a five hour wait in the airport a 14 hour plane ride then we land in new york city switch airports have like another four hour wait and then another three hour plane ride and then like a 30 45 minute drive home we have quite the trek ahead of us Hey buddy, guess what? I brought you back something from South Africa. Can you guess what it is? Um, no. No? All right, here you go. Yeah, and when you're 11 year old, what is it? A shark tooth. What kind is it though? Mm. It's petrified. So it's like old, 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 old. Oh. Pretty cool, huh? Mm -hmm. it, it's a necklace so you can wear it. Can I get it out? You can get it out if you want. What do you think? It's cool. What do you say? Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. So we just got home and we were going through packages for while we were in Africa and this one was in the mail. Mighty nice! Open it. <gasps> Whose name is that? Paisley's. <laughs> Paisley's. I have that you. I heard. Yep. Enjoy. Enjoy watching my channel. Channel and watching. Wanted. Wanted to say thank you. Love. On. Ro. <laughs> Who's our Paisley? What? Love. Look at look at the sticker she sent you. Love. Nerdy nummies. Look. <gasps> yes, I got the nerdy nummies. <laughs> And a pink spatula just for you. What do you say? Thank you. 
Thanks so much for watching this video and watching our trip to Africa. Hey Cam, what was your favorite part? I think my favorite part would have to be the safaris because we saw a lot of mm -hmm. different animals. Mm -hmm. We did the black mamba, which wasn't in video because it <laughs> happened so fast. It was really, really yeah. creepy. <laughs> that was creepy. But I think I just loved Cape Town in general. It was so yeah, beautiful. Really like I was pretty. unprepared for how many beautiful beaches mm -hmm. and mountains were there. If you guys haven't already subscribed to our channel, be sure to do that by clicking the button you can find down below. You can also find lots of our other videos by clicking this right here, this button. And what would you guys do if you could go to Africa? What do you think would be your favorite parts? Leave a comment below and let us know. And we will see you guys next week. Bye, you guys. Bye.